Let's discuss. Rachel back again with another unsigned Sunday video and as I always say on every unsigned Sunday video if you haven't seen one of these before it is exactly what it sounds like on Sunday a video for unsigned bands they have all submitted material to be considered so all of the bands featured on unsigned Sunday have submitted the material themselves it's something they're interested in being featured on so uh, we get to check out some new music I have been slacking on it lately but I'm gonna try to get back into it this is a band I've actually done on unsigned Sunday last year uh, so we're gonna check out their new song from 2022 this came out very shortly into the year it is called song six the band is command 81 I I didn't go over how to submit so if you're in an unsigned band and you want to be submitted considered for unsigned Sunday the list is admittedly very long but we do try to work through that the best we can uh, if you want to be added to it just email your music video along with whatever we might need to know for editing that sort of stuff uh, over to rachelreacts at gmail.com it does take a little bit to get all the requests to to vet them that sort of stuff so uh, it, it is not a quick process but uh, that is how that's done so anyway today we are going to check out another command 81 song i really liked impasse which we checked out before on the channel i will link the video i'll be reacting to today in the description as well as all of their social media other than that i'm going to stop talking and we are going to get straight into it <laughs> Yeah. 
Command 81, song six, let's discuss. For me, I feel the strings are just really stand out to me. It's got a certain style to it. I feel like in the last video I did for them, I just pointed out like that tone being really similar to what I love about Rogue. And this song definitely sounding very similar to me in, in that regard, not similar as a song, you know. Anyway, uh, but I really like this. There were a few things that I feel like could have made it great, like on repeat, on repeat for me, but this will be something I certainly revisit. Uh, that first whole entire minute of the, nearly, I think, full minute, it might have been right before the minute ended uh, that it like kind of let off a bit, but the strings in that first minute are exactly like what I'm talking about if you're wondering why they were stand out for me or anything. Uh, after listening to it for some reason <laughs> the first minute is a great example uh, the chorus for me I love the instrumentals overall in this track um, I would say the only like what I was just talking about uh, what could have brought it up to something I revisit more if the chorus vocals came through a bit more they felt a bit like kind of buried there uh, they sounded strong i like that style and stuff but just everything going on around it was kind of overwhelming to the point where uh, the chorus didn't really hit as hard as i felt like it could have so um had that been a little bit different and just like the build-up felt a little bit uh disproportionate almost like it felt like it really built up into that last chorus for some reason when i felt like uh, the part that came after the chorus maybe it could have built up into or, or something there it just felt like a strange part to get led into. I was like, where are we? Oh, okay, we're back into the chorus again. Uh, it was just kind of like a strange feel to me on the first listen, that is. Uh, but again, I still really enjoy this track. The vocals overall, those unclean vocals specifically. Yes, uh, the drumming, definitely a level of intensity in this song. Like uh, the fast pace in the chorus, the fast pace overall, it was really, uh, you, there were a couple of breaks in the song, like in verses and, and such, but uh, the overall feel of the song was just a very fast paced one. Some of the drumming, like what I was talking about with that buildup um, into that last chorus and just overall having like that speed, whereas, you know, I felt like in the last song there was a bit less of that that sort of energetic feel so i'm interested to see what else will be on here uh, as i said these are things that i felt like could have made it like up a level on repeat a lot for me not saying that like i don't i won't revisit or anything because i really enjoyed it as you could probably tell uh, stand out for me definitely the strings unclean vocals i i really like the sound of the clean vocals too uh, or those you know that that sort of sound on on the chorus so i do it's not that I didn't like them, I just felt like they kind of didn't hit the way that I would have wanted it to, where it would have been like, oh, that chorus, you know, uh, where it had the potential to really do that. But this is definitely a band I will keep my eye on. They have a ton of potential. I love the sound. I will link the video I reacted to as well as all of their social media in the description of this video. Make sure you check them out. Give them some love if you enjoyed this. Other than that, you can also find my link tree in the description, which will have the invite for the Discord server that I talk about in every video, every live stream. It's full of a bunch of my favorite people. We talk about a lot of music-related stuff and a lot of stuff completely unrelated to music as well. A lot of different channels going on in there. So if you're interested in coming and check that out, that will be there as well as my Instagram profile link. On Instagram, I do keep it all music related. Uh, Friday, I post a chart of what I've listened to the most over the course of the week. Course of the week. Uh, top 25 albums, EPs, singles, whatever the case may be for that week. And then I also post on their merch, sweatshirts, vinyl, t-shirts, flags, whatever I have ready to go that week. Uh, my never ending merch collection. There is always something to post for merch. And then if I've been to a show recently and have anything to post, I'll post about that on my story about new videos, that sort of stuff, you get the idea. Uh, so if that interests you at all, my handle on there is Rachel Reacts, just like my YouTube channel. But as I said, that will be in the link tree in the description if you have any interest in following me. As always, thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it.